How's it going everyone? My name is Bobby and you're watching Mind Island Design. Today I'm going to show you how to create a compound path in Illustrator. I find myself using compound paths mostly for when I'm creating window decals or vehicle wraps and I'll show you what I mean here. So I'm just going to create a few squares to replicate uh, a few windows. I'll make the stroke 5 so we can see it a bit better and I'll make the center transparent. <laughs> and if you can hear that wind I'm so sorry it is very windy outside. So I'm just going to drag that over and hit Command or Control D to replicate that. And I'll just group this and align that to center. So now in our layers, we can see all the different windows or squares. So now with all your objects selected, you want to go to Object, Compound Path, and Make. And you'll see that it brought them all together in one group. It's not really a group, but it's a, it's a compound. So I'm just going to bring in this design I have here. And I'll scale this up a little bit, or quite a bit, just so it goes past all of the windows. And I'll just align that to center as well. So you want to bring your compound path above your design, and then select everything, go to Object, Clipping Mask, and Make. So now you see that, um, well, it's exactly what you want. Each window has its own decals or designs or whatever uh, you're using your compound path for. So yeah, that is how you create a compound path in Illustrator. I hope this video helped. If it did, please hit subscribe and follow us on all of our social media to stay connected and never miss a new tutorial. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.